And it begins. What you are about to witness may shock and surprise you. You are about to watch the new, the improved Lizard Circus. Ah, I mean the blue cast giant. So let's get to the terrible jokes, the loud music, and the serious business. So yeah, I actually got around to making another one of these things. Now you can constantly be reminded of my epic photo shipping skills. But that's aside from the point. So let's get started. In recent news, there was this YTPMV collab called the What Is Love collab. And I'm really no expert on YTPMVs in the slightest bit. But I really found this collab to be amazing. And I know I am not the only one who thought so. There's also a tennis tournament currently going on at Uchu. I've checked out several of the matches. They are all nothing short of awesome. So you should drop by, see some of those, and vote for your favorites. There's also a bunch of good collabs being set up at the moment. I think I'll just list those in the description since there's not too much to say about them. I'll also list the YTPMV collab and a link to the tennis tournament. Now it's time for the real deal. I have this great, 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 great ambitious project that I want to do now. Sort of like a research into the community. But I cannot do it without your help. As you probably know, not everybody likes YouTube food. But those people are nerds, so who cares? And of course not everybody gets involved with the community that is YouTube food. However, some people do. Obviously. Since I couldn't really be making that video, this video, if that wasn't true. And all these guys who get into the community have a story. They have a name. They have their own personality and their own way of thinking. Now, before I get into this, don't misunderstand. Bender already did his Who YouTube Hoopers Are project. And I'm, and I'm not going to do anything like that. That's not at all what I'm trying to do. What I want to know is what is it specifically that got these guys into the community? And why are they here? I want to know the backstory of YouTube Hoopers right before they started taking interest in the community. What provoked them to make their own videos and share them with everyone? I want to know why they enjoy making videos and what their reasons are for doing so. That's where you guys come in, because you are those people. The majority of you guys watching are YouTube Hoopers, and you have a story. Something happened to me that, to you, that made, why well, it happened to me too, that made you find YouTube Hoop and get involved with it. So what I want is for you guys to send me an audio clip. I don't care how you get it to me, as long as you can get it to me, and I can download it. In this clip, I need to know a short description of your personality and beliefs. Nothing personal or anything like that. Just things like, are you shy in real life? Are you an artistic person? You like drawing, writing? Stuff like that. It needs to have how you discover YouTube. What were you doing that led you to click on that strange video? And if you can, Identify like what the video was by source or style, whatever you can. And lastly, you need to explain the reason why you joined the community and why do you make your videos. Do you love attention? Subscribers? Just the fun of making them? Being able to express yourself in a silly fashion? All in all, this shouldn't go too much over a minute. It can, but it shouldn't too much. And any YouTube pooper can submit an audio clip for this. I may not use them all, but I will keep you in mind when I come to make my final conclusion about everything, even if I don't use your audio. If you don't have a way to record yourself, but would still like to take part in this project, send me a message. Explain all the things that you would have talked about if you had a mic or whatever, and I may do the talking for you, unless you want me to keep things private then just say, I'd rather not have people know about this. That's mostly it. I ought to give you an example though, so here's one for myself. Hello, I'm Joe the Blue Dragon. I'm 17, and I'm a YouTube pooper who uses a bunch of different styles of YouTube poop. I'm not too talkative in real life, but I have a few friends that I like to talk to and hang out with. I love writing stories, but I can't draw a single thing for my life. In 2009, I was born one day, started going to YouTube, watching some Mario videos, gameplay, and other stupid stuff. I came across a Hotel Mario video and starting watching these Hotel Mario poops. Soon I realized there were YouTube poops for all kinds of sources, and I started being friends with some of these creators of the videos. 
around the time, a lot of my friends in real life started stabbing me in the back, and pretty much just plain forgetting I existed. These YouTube poopers, these guys I didn't even know in real life, seemed to care about me more than most of my real friends did. So when I created my account, Joe the Blue Dragon, I wanted to become a part of this community for good, to be involved in this great thing. I make my videos for just the fun of it. I don't really care much about subscribers. None of mine watch my poops. And nobody aside from them views them anyway. So it's just a fun little hobby I like to do. And that's how it should sound. Only, of course, you'll have your own story that's probably way different than mine. So record them, write them, whatever it is you need to do to get them to me. And just find a way to send them to me so I can download them and I can use them. They'll be featured on the show and get lots of attention and subscribers. Uh, you probably won't, but still do it anyway. Nobody asked me any questions on the last video besides a bunch of jokes like, Can I be featured? So don't hesitate to ask me anything in the comments. I will answer them next time. And I'll give a shout out to three guys again. Colin Maloney's Ombre, the Great Pooper, and the host of the Chucklevision collab. Durdred Fuh? I think I got your name right. He's really good too. And lastly, Master of Zorork. Hopefully I didn't butcher your name too badly. Anyways, all three of them are really great. I'll link to them in the description, and you should check them out. So that's about it. I think I've pretty much figured the groove of how this whole Bluecast thing's gonna work now. So get your audio clips in, get featured on the show, and I'll see you next time.